Did you know that past lives can significantly impact your current life? Let me share a quick story to illustrate. In my hypnosis sessions, I ask my client to be shown a past life that is relevant to their current life in some way before we connect to and talk to their higher self. I had a client who was a woman who has been dealing with an eight-year legal battle for custody of her daughter. She has custody of her daughter, but her daughter's father keeps bringing her back to court all the time, making her life a living hell. She feels like she's really at her wit's end as she faces more court battles. So we were shown a past life where she was a little boy, about 12 or 13 years old, lived kind of a privileged life with a mother and a father and a younger sister. Dad was strict. Mom was very depressed. She definitely had some mental challenges and he would work to try to keep mom happy and also entertain the sister and kind of act like a buffer between mom and the little sister. Fast forward two or three years and something happened with the little sister. He couldn't tell what, but she was no longer alive and mom also unalived herself. Dad told him he needed to man up about the situation. Fast forward and we saw him as an older man and he had just completely given up on life. He wasn't depressed, he wasn't happy, he did have a lot of anger, but he really just didn't want to be around anyone and had completely given up. He died grumpy and lonely, completely disconnected from everyone else. After he died in that life, I said, what kind of insight can you give me now looking back on that life? And he said, I feel like I wasted that entire life. Whatever happened to my mom and sister, life stopped for me and I just gave up. And the rest of my life was a waste because I did not engage at all. And get this, the little sister in that lifetime is the same soul that is her daughter in this lifetime. Next, we came to the point in her session where I brought forth her higher self. And the first question I asked was, why did you show her that particular life? Her higher self said she lost her daughter in that lifetime and gave up. And she's doing the same thing in this one. She's giving up on life. Now, this story actually gets really wild about what's going on between her and her daughter's father, and I can't get into that in this video. Let's just say that his soul is not there and he's not human. I know that might be a lot to grasp, but join me on Friday, May 17 for a live where I'm going to go through that whole session and describe to you what her higher self said. The time is 8 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. Central, 6 p.m. Mountain, and 5 p.m. Pacific. And don't forget to subscribe for more past life and higher self stories.